we are discussing esc 2019 prelims questions and their answers there was no questions from the eaa for last two years but this time there are some questions from eaa let us see the question is environmental impact assessment is aimed to help options estimate future needs of the society smooth implementation of a project cope with a rapid increase in population fourth is resource conservation so what is eia it is not about the future needs of the society it is about implementation of the project and the particular project we are considering impact of that project and it is not about increasing in population so we are not concerned with uh, population factors here we are concerned with the development economic development so we have confusion between two options smooth implementation of the of a project and resource conservation so among this which will be the better option we can see larger aim of the e is sustainable development and in sustainable development we have to maintain the overall quality of life that is societal consideration socio economic considerations and we have to get the natural resources we should not deplete the natural resources we should get a continuous supply of natural resources and we should not damage the environment also and so from the option among smooth implementation of a project and resource conservation resource conservation seems to be a better option because it is in line with the larger objective of the ea so d will be the answer now let us go to the next question an ea is study of probable changes in the socio economic and biophysical characteristics of the environment that may result from a proposed action statement 2 the purpose of an ea is to help design projects which do not disturb the quality of the environment by examining alternatives so just now only we discussed about eaa we saw these two statements statement one is correct because eaa study the probable changes and what is its purpose its purpose is to design the project that do not disturb the quality of the environment so if a project is having larger environmental damage we will go for alternatives we will select the alternatives based on our assessment so this statement is also correct so here is a confusion whether we should go with option a or option b these two statements are independent because one uh, says about the what is eaa and one says about the purpose but if we examine purpose explains why we are doing the eaa why we should study the probable changes in the socio economic and biophysical characteristics of the environment because our aim is to help design project which do not disturb the quality of the environment so in this sense we can tell that statement 2 explains the statement 1 we can conclude that both statements are individually true and statement second is the correct explanation of statement first so we can go with the option a next question statement on training should be conducted among the line and low management for ensuring the importance of environmental protection plan second environmental science is a developing subject and the people implementing environment strategy should re remain up to date with the environment control process so epp environment protection plan or environment management plan is part of eaa so the project get, gets environmental clearance on the basis of this plan so they are also supposed to keep a sufficient number of trained and competent individuals to carry out the activities as per the plan it means that the both statements are true so we should choose between either a or b why training should be conducted among the people who are implementing the project so they have to remain updated with the 
process strategy is handled so training is required and the project implementer is supposed to keep the people trained so the statement second is the correct explanation of the statement first so a will be the answer